Hello everyone, we're going to talk a little bit more about the Oh Can You Say Dinosaur book because there were some very, very tricky words in that book and at the back of the book there's a thing called a glossary. A glossary is a little bit like a dictionary and it explains some of the words that we've read in the story. The first word is brood and that means a number of young hatched all at one time. A carnivore is an animal that eats flesh or meat. Dinosaurs meaning terrible lizards that is the name of the large group of reptiles that live between 230 and 65 million years ago. No one quite knows why they disappeared after that. Fierce means wild, savage and mean. Foe means an enemy. Fossils, the remains or the impressions of animals or plants that lived millions of years ago. Gobble, to swallow and eat in a hurry. And that's what your mum always says, don't gobble your dinner, eat it properly. Herbivore, an animal that eats plants. Jab, to poke with something sharp. That's something we would never do. Labs, short for laboratories. These are the places where scientists conduct tests and experiments to find the answers to many questions. Muck, dirty, slimy, rotting plant and animal matter. Muck is what your knees look like when you've played rugby on a wet day. Museum, a building where objects of interest or value are kept and shown. Muzzle, the part of an animal's head that sticks out, jaws, mouth and nose. Pierce, to make a hole with something sharp. Zucchini, another name for a courgette. A vegetable that looks like a small cucumber. While the brain of a brachiosaur was only the size of a small zucchini, the average human brain is bigger than a grapefruit. Wow!